Ready? Alrighty. Okay. What's going on, guys? Welcome to I, our first review. Yeah, this is our first reaction video. Reaction video. Uh, so, as a lot of you guys know, we're really big Monster Hunter fans. Uh, we need over 800 hours. Yeah. For Monster Hunter World. Yeah. Um, we've played a ton. Uh, between Chaotic Batch and I, we've actually played all of the Monster Hunters. Uh, minus the newest one that came out on Switch. That's coming out on Switch. Oh, just coming out on Switch. Um, <clears throat> and we've actually started streaming it again on our channel. So, um, when we got news a while back that they were making a Monster Hunter movie, we were super, super excited. And then we weren't. <laughs> because we saw screenshots and stuff like that, and the cast list, and... Yeah, that's a big one. So today, uh, the official trailer has actually dropped. So we are going to watch it for the first time. Uh, I guess react to it. I, yeah. I don't have high hopes. I, I have. I'm going in here with about as much expectations as I had. I have going into Batman, if not less. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> so, let's get into it. If I can find the right mouse. I'm going in this with this, as much expectations as I gave Dragon Ball Evolution <laughs> expectations for. To be fair, you were hyped for it. <laughs> I was hyped You were for hyped for it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not hyped for this. Welcome, mate. This is Bravo Team. Do you copy? Storm incoming. Send immediate support. Captain. What'd you find? It's definitely Bravo Team, but the tracks end here. They can't just disappear. Where the hell did that come from? Back in the vehicle! It's getting on us! What the hell just happened? On our six! Holy... How did we get here? Stop! We are not your enemy. We're soldiers. Give me a hand! But we need weapons. <laughs> Gotta tell me about that. What happened to your family? Not us. If we can get into their world, we can get into ours. My God. Gotta get home. You with me? It's definitely Bravo team, but the tracks end here. They can't just disappear. Where the hell did that come from? Back in the vehicle! Okay, that's okay, that's the first thing. Uh where is it? <laughs> what is the stone tablet thing? <laughs> yeah, what is that supposed to be? I mean, I guess they have to find a way to get people from their world to... Uh, well, you know, you could just make a movie in that fucking world. Already, instead of, you know, transporting characters yeah. into it. Yeah, yeah. We're, thir we're 13 seconds in, and I'm already annoyed. And then we have this giant fucking fuck-off storm right here, which I don't get. Which suddenly teleports them into the Monster Hunter Yeah, realm. so that's gonna be interesting to see how they explain that. Uh, and then we have Big Sexy Boy right here. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Okay, when he popped out, that that looked dope. That right there. Yeah, yeah. And anyone who plays Monster Hunter knows that right there. Okay, <laughs> no, no, I knew right away because whenever I saw on our six, that, <laughs> you see that trail coming. Bad things are fixing to happen. That's what you're holy. 
right there. That looks amazing. That does look amazing. And then there's Cry. You know the obvious yeah. Cry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that. At least I got that. Because that was everybody's face the first time you fight him. He pops out of the crowd and it's just like, oh, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm happy they chose the Black Diablos, too. The which female? is the female version. Yeah. But that, that one's the male. How does it get here? I guess you call it Resident Evil. Yeah. I call it Resident Evil. And then that. Like, that that's a great shot. So are they going to be doing, like... It looks like they're taking it in the place of actual Monster Hunter world. Maybe. Yeah. Because that looks like the ancient forest. Yeah. The other place is obviously the wasteland. Well, yeah, but that shot there, I mean, that's in that's the ancient, ancient forest. forest. Yeah. That's right around the area, it looks like, that you have to fight Toby. Yeah. Which begs the question, is Toby going to be playing a part? Or are we going to see him? Yeah. Because so far, we have seen Diablos and... Black Diablos, Rathalos. Yeah. And that's it. Yeah. And then that. That looks like a mixture between the, uh, like the, the Hunter's Lodge, like the first one you get, or the ship. Yeah, it looks like the ship. So that's, that's interesting. Stop! We are not your enemy. There's Black Diablos. Yeah, but this is the other thing that I wanted to, to uh, that, that I know. So that right there, that almost looks like Zora. Yeah. Because in World, there's no other place with lava other than Zora. Yeah, that's true. Uh, the... Oh no, the Elder's Recess has lava in it. That's true. That's true. But you, but you never see a mountain range like yeah, that. Yeah, you don't see a mountain range. Our soldiers, give me a hand! <laughs> that. Uh, yeah, that's wow. not happening. This, this, this is bad. It does not matter how fast that will be, is, you are not outrunning the Diablos. See, and that's that's the Black Diablos, that's the yeah. female. So, like, it, it's cool that, that we're going to see male and female. But we need weapons. Uh, that. Six. Yeah, the Weasel. Ah! I mean, at least she drops them because she freaks out from the charge it gets. True. That's funny. True, and I do like his armor. Like that's armor that you would I feel see. Like he's in the supposed game. to be the commander's son from World. The one that carries that the makes big sense. Sword that makes sense back. because he actually like they. <laughs> Gotta tell me about that. Okay, that's the ship from the start of the game. Yeah. You know, and the only reason I know that is because of that, because of the the nose of it. What happened to your family? Let's, let's go back. Okay, right there. So right here, we have the bow. One of my favorite weapons. And mm -hmm. then you've got the fuck-off sword. Yeah, and he's dual-wielding. Which is interesting. Interesting. Unless... I mean, I was always a fan of the idea of being able to carry two weapons. Like a yeah. charge blade, and then maybe like the leap sticks as a backup. In case, my, <laughs> in case my charge blade decides to dole out in the middle of combat. Yeah. But see, quick swap. see like, I, like, like, I like that. Like, take my bow and then take my lance. Or my gun lance. But I like that they brought in the big fuck-off sword because it's, it's, the, it's the icon. That's what everybody yeah. knows from Monster Hunter. So I like that. And it actually, like, from what we can tell, it looks really, really good. It does. I, l I really like how they did the bow. Like, I like how big it is, because that's about how big it, it looks in the game. It's about <laughs> the size of a normal human, so... Yeah, yeah. and the giant fuck-off arrows. And the Rathlos. Yeah, the Rathlos. And that's just a fucking killer shot right there. And there it is again, the cry. The cry. At least they get the cries right. Now her. Handler. She's the handler. Handler, yeah. yeah. As, as soon as At she... least she's cuter than the handler in world. <laughs> true. Very, very true. 
I mean, when you dress your handler up from as the main villain from Resident Evil that's what, remake. <laughs> that, that's why I was laughing last night when we started streaming because I forgot that I put mine in a full palico suit. <laughs> so I go back to camp and there's just a giant palico there. Yeah. She went to pull something out of the oven and I saw this evil <laughs> zombie face. We can get you to their world. Athlos. Okay. Goes something like that. So that looks like the shot uh, right after you start the game where you have to start tracking the Great Jagras. Mm -hmm. When you go out of your base and you go to the left. And you I was thinking it. it looks more like the jump off the waterfall. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that too. That too. Well, no, because on that, there's a bunch of force over here. Yeah, that's but, true. But over here, like, normally you have to go down that path and then you have to go right, because that's normally where Great Jagras comes out. Oh. If you get into ours. What? That. The fact that they put a, what is that, a C-130 <laughs> yeah. in the Monster Hunter world, like, the Humvee alone was bad enough in the Monster Hunter world, but now you got a, a giant fucking UAV plane True. in the Monster Hunter world. Okay, but, but, I don't think that that's a shot from the Monster Hunter world, mainly because of the road. Yeah, that's because true. Because there's nowhere in Monster, like, vehicles aren't a thing other than the ship. That's true. So it might be the monster coming over all Exactly. Because she doesn't get into ours. My god. And uh, that. <laughs> that right red there. <laughs> Just like, that is such a, a gorgeous shot. What do you do in your life if you're flying a plane and suddenly that thing lands on it? I think you just let go and start praying. Bend over and kiss your ass goodbye. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I just noticed that. So, right there. Like, he lands on the wings, and then he just rips the wings right off. He was like, yeah, have fun with that. <laughs> as, as, as he takes flight, so, yeah. I gotta get home. Okay, that's the other thing. She has the clutch claw. Mm-hmm. I saw it. Like, but, but one, the reach. Two... Well, no, because the clutch claw has a pretty decent reach to it. It does. You, You and I know that from, like... Proven fact. I just feel like that's a bad, you know, clutch claw right there. No. Because you, you're on his horn, for one. You can see the claw on his horn. Alright? You're going to be pulling yourself right up to his face as he's smacking his head down on yeah. you. Well, the, well f for one, that's that's the female. That's that's the black Diablos. The only saving grace that she might have is that the Diablos are pretty much blind. That is true. So... You with me? Yeah! And Tony Cha. I, I fucking love him. And then that's, yeah, that's still Black Gallows. With a giant arrow coming toward him. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and then the fucking Weave Six again. And here's the other thing that raised quite a bit of concern. Okay, so it looks like that might be Tony Cha. She has the weep six out with the charge. Mm -hmm. what do against that? Nothing. Like that's that's bad. That's all bad right there. Yeah, and last time I checked, the weep sticks don't have a blocking no. mechanism. <laughs> they don't. You have <laughs> dodge. You have dodge. That's it. You have hit, dip, hit, dip, hit, yeah, dip. So. I'm definitely intrigued. I, mean, I, I, I don't... I, I think that all of my excitement from this comes from the monsters. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be how they portray the monsters. I'm not really interested in the human characters on this. Well, I'm interested in Tony Jaw's character. Because he actually, like you said, he, he looks like, like the grandson from The Elder. Yeah. So, I'm excited to see that. And if anybody could pull that off, it would be him. And we can the handler. I wonder if she's as annoying as... You know... Maybe. Yeah, you were fixing to try to impersonate. <laughs> um, I wonder if she's hungry. <laughs> I wonder if she's gonna grab a bite. <laughs> um, um, so, I'm interested to see the weapons that they bring into the movie. But you notice one key factor missing from all of those scenes. Mm. Where's the Palico? Okay, that, that was my other thing. Are they gonna bring Palicos into it? Because they see one! Because they're a really big part of the game. They are one of the main parts of the game. <laughs> um, so I'm interested to see the weapons. No hunter in their right mind thinks they could do anything without their palico next to them. <laughs> yeah. Um, 
I'm really interested to see what other monsters they bring. Because so far we've only seen Melee Female, Diablos, and Rathalos. That's yep. it. But there's a ton of other iconic I'm monsters. I'm hoping to see an Angie. Ooh, yeah. An Angie. I want to see a Toby. That would be... Dude, Jagras, Toby, Angie. They've already got Melee Female, Diablos, Rathalos, Rathian. Um, Barth. Yeah. Jarotodus, because they're in the wasteland, so that's Jarotodus. Basil guys would be cool to see, but I highly doubt Oh, that I don't think they're going to bring, bring Beetlejuice in. <laughs> Funny, oh. you got planes bombing, and then you have Basil guys bombing the planes over oh, the town. Oh, that would be sick. <laughs> um, what else? I doubt very highly they're going to bring any of the Elders in. There's, no, there's no way. No. Um... So, eh, I mean, I, I give the trailer like a 5 out of 10, but it's all for the monsters. That's all for the monsters. <laughs> it's, it's for the monsters. Like, I have no hopes on Mila Djokovic. I mean, and it's made by the same guys. Excuse me. They did Resident Evil, and they really screwed up that movie. So... It's series. Yeah, it's the whole fucking series. But... Maybe you guys will catch our reaction video on the trailer they're going to drop for the new Resident Evil movie coming out, too. The whole, they're scrapping the entire old series. They've recasted. Really? Oh, that's right, yeah, because you and I were talking about that. I'm not happy with the casting. The only one I think I'm happy with is uh, Stephen Amell's brother. Mm. And that's because I think he can pull off a of Chris Redfield. But, like we were talking about last time on the show, I mean, they've been able to do some pretty amazing stuff with cast. That's true, too. So. But some of the hope that I have on the cast for that. Yeah. Some people just don't seem to fit, like, who they're getting to play Jill all the time. Again. We will see. Yeah. We never know. I mean, she's got to be better than, than. Mila? Yeah. I mean, you could have thrown. For Jill Valentine, I probably would have thrown, like, Scarlett Johansson, someone who's had it. The ability to play a fast, quick, fair point, stealthy person. Fair point. But guys, this has been our reaction to the brand new Monster Hunter trailer. Uh, I definitely encourage you to go to YouTube, watch it for yourselves. Um, let us know your feedback. You know, did you like it? Did you not like it? What did you like or dislike about uh, you know about the trailer? <laughs> you guys will notice that my mouth dropped, my jaw dropped as soon as Diablo's popped out of that dude. I went. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I still, even after watching the trailer, the only reason I want to see the movie is to see the monsters. Like, yeah, like I hope there's a good story that goes along with it. But for right now, suddenly I, I saw a stone it. tablet with a storm that swallowed up a bunch of military people that yeah. were in the desert. So I mean, so far I'm not seeing it, and it doesn't make sense because I don't know how you would transport between their world and our world. Because if we could do that, that'd be freaking epic. Although I think we'd all be dead. But hey. <laughs> but, you guys, thank y'all for watching. I'm Iron Business of One. Kevin Bash. I'll see y'all next time.